Hello and welcome back to another HitFilm tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can create a camera solve for use inside of HitFilm Express. This can be used to composite your 3D models if you have the 3D model input or your 3D effects or your 3D layers into a video footage where the camera is moving. I will be using Blender, HitFilm and a Blender add-on made by FX Home. In this tutorial I will be showing you how you can install the add-on and how to export your camera data over to HitFilm. I will not be showing you how to track your footage but I have put some links in the description for some good tutorials on how to do that inside of Blender. So let's get on with this tutorial. Okay so the first thing that you're going to want to do is download the Blender camera data export script. This can be found in the description of the creating a Thor hammer catch effect plus free 3D model uh, video put out by FX Home. There will also be a link in the description to this tutorial and also to the Blender camera data export script. Then you want to click on this link and it will take you over to GitLab. So then you want to press the download button just here. And then I selected zip then you want to save this zip file somewhere on your computer where you can remember where it is. When it downloads you then want to find this in your file explorer and then you want to unzip this zip file by right clicking and then extract all. And now it's extracted all of these files out of the zip folder. And the main one you need to pay attention to is the io underscore export underscore hit film which is a python file. Then you want to load up blender you want to go to edit, then down to preferences, and now we need to install that Python file as an add-on. And it's not automatically going to be in here, so we need to press this install button. Then you want to find the file that you have just downloaded, and then you want to find the io underscore export underscore hitfilm.py file, and then press install add-on from file. Then it will reload up the Blender preferences and you want to check the checkbox next to import and export uh, FX Home Hit Film HFCS file. This has now activated the add-on which will now allow you to export your Blender projects as Hit Film composite shots with their moving camera data and where 3D objects are positioned. Then you can close the Blender preferences tab and now if you go over to file export you will now see at the bottom there is one called FX Home Hit Film which means that you can now export your camera movement and your object positions. Then you want to go ahead and track your footage. I'm not that good at Blender and I had to follow a whole bunch of tutorials on how to do this and I found a really good one. I've put a link to it in the description it was by CG Matter. It's a really easy to follow tutorial uh, so if you want to track your footage then go and watch that. There's another one that I've put in the description which you can follow along if you don't want to use tracking markers because I use tracking markers and so did the tutorial that I said first. So go ahead and track your footage. Okay, so once you've done this, you will have a camera that moves with your real camera. You might have a shadow catcher and a cube when it first loads up uh, and you just want to delete them. And then we're just left with the camera so now we want to use the add-on that we just installed by going up to File, go to Export, and then select the HitFilm property. And then you want to save this somewhere on your computer, and then press Export to FX Home HitFilm. This has now exported your camera movement data as a HitFilm composite shot. So now you want to load up HitFilm Express. Okay, so I am inside of a new project inside of HitFilm Express, and next to the Import button there is an arrow. When you select this, it will bring up more options for things that you can import. If you select Composite Shot, it will then bring up the File Explorer, and then you want to locate your newly exported file, which will be a HitFilm Composite Shot. Then you want to hit Open. And as you can see, this creates a new Composite Shot, which has the camera movement in it. Then if you also import the footage that you used to track, and then if you drag this into your composite shot, you will now see that you've got a camera track that perfectly matches your footage. And this is what you want to see. 
This now means that you can incorporate 3D layers and 3D effects into your footage and the camera will match. So if I just create a new 3D plane, you will see that the camera moves around it properly. So that was how you can create a camera track inside of HitFilm Express completely for free uh, using Blender and the script that HitFilm released. I hope you enjoyed this, if you did then please leave a like and subscribe, and if you want to see any other tutorials then please comment down below what you would like to see. Goodbye.